That's a Pitch Perfect cast covering Nicki Minaj along with many young voices from across the country and this all-girl comedy is being talked about as being the next Bridesmaids and joining us here in the Daily Buzz studio is one of the rising stars of the film, it's Hannah Mae Lee. Thank you very much for coming in of today. Of course. Now we had the premiere last night just down the road at the Arclight Theatre, the after party, this film's got a lot of buzz, tell me about it, how was last night? Last night was amazing. It's like we finally got, everything was done, everyone's all dressed up, getting ready to party. It was just celebratory and just amaze balls and <laughs> it was just, everyone looked beautiful and it was so great. And there was karaoke at the after party, which I just watched and it was fine and there was food <laughs> and there was drinks. It was amazing. So this film really has brought together a, an ensemble of rising stars, you being one of them. Tell us about the premise of the film and what people can expect. Well, the premise of the film is uh, based on two major acapella groups, the Bard and Bellas and the Troublemakers. And the Troublemakers is a boy band and they always, the boy, a boy band, yeah. the, the boy group and they always win. So like the Bard and Bellas, like they finally give it their all. It's like the new group of misfits and um, that's kind of like the nice mosaic in the end that brings us all together and makes us freaking aka fierce. <laughs> so how did you manage to find your way to this film set? Your past clearly is around beatboxing, which you can do a little of, I'm told. I can do a little, but um, I, I was coached because before I was hired on this film, I couldn't even like do a lick of beatboxing. It was just like, <laughs> um, so so they taught me a lot. I learned everything from the BTKs to like the ara ara. <laughs> it's amazing to think that your parents actually wanted you to go to the FBI at one point. I read. Yeah, you know, like mom's here in the my studio off the here. back. She's yeah. really supportive. Hi, mom. You look beautiful. <laughs> my dad um, isn't here because he's still pissed that I didn't join the FBI. But <laughs> but dad, I could play one on TV. That's the best part, dad. <laughs> Gonna work but out. your parents really right. did want you to become an FBI agent. Yeah, especially my, my dad. I, I decided I wanted to be like go into more fashion design before going into acting and I was gonna work for a certain company in New York and he's like, this is perfect, perfect time for you to be an FBI agent. Like, like you're in the fashion business, you know, there's so many mafia stuff that happens. <laughs> I was like, dad, I'm not gonna join the FBI. <laughs> <laughs> but speaking uh, of your other talents, you are a designer as well. And I am, I made this. Did you stand my... up? Give us a look, I wanna see this. this. Is me. Twirl, give it's me a twirl. a little bit of a mic in the back. Oh, I like, I like, I like, I like. But um, this is, yeah. You designed this. I did. It's a Hanamon original with the rings. Hey, what, what? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> um, um, what, what would you say an inspiration is for your designs? Um, I would say boredom <laughs> and a lot of anger that comes in my culture. Okay. It just helps me bring a lot of flair. And a lot of the rings, it's like my brain goes like 90 miles an hour with a bunch of conversations by myself and answering them. So I like to think of my rings as like conversation pieces that hugging your fingers like 80 conversations all hugging on to the fingers. Now everyone's excited about this film I've got to say at Celeb Buzz we have been covering this film from the start as part of a huge campaign to drive awareness to Pitch Perfect it was actually our pitch slapped cap campaign but I've got to say I think with the exception of you what makes this film is someone from my native homeland Rebel Wilson. Rebel's pretty amazing. Why is she amazing? Because she's funny and you know what the thing is Rebel's a really smart girl She's funny, she's smart, she's, you know, she she does her improv really like, you know, she, she plans it all out and she's very, she's an overall good person which her, which makes her so likable, not just on camera but off camera. Sure. And she has a beautiful face where I just look at her and I just want to go, <laughs> <laughs> So what's next for you? Besides um, your mother laughing there in the corner <laughs> of your like, jokes. She's like, what just happened? Yeah. <laughs> you want to make out with a girl? I'm feeling awkward right <laughs> now. Just a little awkward. What's next um, for you? Well, God, there's a lot, but you know what? I'm like, let's just throw on the towel. I'm done. <laughs> yeah, it, right. I don't believe so. that for one minute. <laughs> um, I'm actually trying to sell a couple of TV pilots right now. Oh, uh, yeah? Yes, and there's we're trying to buy the rights of a show right now, which I can't say right now online. But um, And other than that, just comedies, more clothes. I do a lot of stand-up around L.A., but I'm really looking forward to like pitching some of those pilots out. Good stuff. Those are fun. It's All right. Girls. You heard it here first. 
you got to watch this one. This one's going to be a star on the rise in Hollywood. Hannah May Lee, thank you very much thank for coming you. in. It's been great to have you. And you can see Pitch Perfect in theatres October 5. Next, here on The Daily Buzz, we're catching eyeballs on celebbuzz.com.